hello everyone welcome to learn it today i'm going to discuss about python so which python so i'm going to discuss about uh, obviously python programming language so before discussing about uh, python programming language first we will look why python programming language we have many languages like c c++ java javascript html css etc we have many languages so why you should learn python so first we will see when python came into existence so python came into existence in the year of 1980 you know who is the inventor of python so the python inventor is guido van rusen so why guido van rusen invented uh, created python so there are, there was c already when guido van rusen was there he was using c language so whenever he used to write in c language it was uh, pretty tough uh, to remember it's not tough but it is uh, tough for beginners like uh, us people who don't know programming so it was uh, pretty tough so he thought of inventing a language creating a language which is user friendly and uh, he want he also wanted to create a language which also makes uh, common users uh, to get interested in uh, programming so this was his aim so he was uh, keen in, the, in this and uh, he started uh, working on uh, python and finally he developed python python was from 1980s but it was not that much popular even java was there but uh, python was not popular at that time eventually the days passed and uh, 2000 2005 2010 2015 uh, the time was passing so java is uh, mostly used but uh, python is uh, overcoming uh, java so python is a general purpose programming language so python is a general purpose programming language we can use literally python for anything like uh, we can use uh, python for scripting we can use python for programming so why is python climbing uh, the ranks and uh, getting into the first position beating java one of the big one of the most uh, uh renowned uh, programming language so it is uh, climbing the ram ranks so first we will see why it is climbing the ranks and going to the first position by beating java c c++ and everything it went all up because of ai so you know ai artificial intelligence so what do which language do we use so what do you think which da- language do we use in uh, artificial intelligence obviously we can use java we can use python but we will use only python mostly everyone will use python because python is simple you can write uh, codes uh, or programs very simply like uh, if you want to write hello program in java it will take some lines but in uh, python you just write hello it hello so that's how much easy python is so learning some languages that are too tough like java and again implementing in ai it's uh, senseless so they what uh, what they did is uh, they chose one language so python as it was simple its syntax was simple it is easy to write and the lines of code was reduced it also if the lines of code is reduced then the memory will be reduced so it uh, became uh, easy python was easy so they adopted python so python is used in ai used in data science python is used in every uh, everything like in 20 as if you are a programmer or uh, if you want uh, any thing if you want to go to programming side you python is a must learn language java is also a must learn language but uh, i love python python is uh, very simple once i start teaching you python you will feel uh, wow this is python i want to learn python you won't feel uh, programming as boring when you learn in python but in java i will definitely feel it boring but in python it's not the case you will feel very 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 interesting so this is what python is don't you feel uh, python is very cool so we can use it in ai yeah you know artificial intelligence that is uh, a big talk nowadays so if you want to learn artificial intelligence then you should know python there is no way that you can skip python if you want to do some innovation you should learn python now so this is how much cool 
python is so you if you want to go for data science you must learn python if you want to go for ai you must learn python so python you must learn so i will be teaching complete python in my youtube series so you can uh, keep following my channel uh, for python videos i will be teaching python from scratch you don't need to be a programmer or you don't need to be knowing programming before so you can learn python from my videos even though if you are not a csc student if you are even a 10th class kid also learn python that's how easy python is so it is not complicated like c it is not complicated like java or anything so python is very simple so what uh, i wanted to say so what i'm going to teach in python so python i will teach python so i will after completing python i will surely teach uh, ai and uh, data analysis so after python i will be learning uh, ai so i request you to follow my youtube series on uh, python so this is about uh, all about python so what is python so which type of programming language is it as you know if you are from java background you may know that uh, java is a object oriented uh, programming language so what is python so is python is also a object oriented programming language or is it not so python is uh, an object oriented programming language wow that's great so what is an object oriented programming language so object oriented programming language we will see it later so before uh, uh, discussing object oriented concepts and everything we must know what type of language python is so generally python is a scripting language you can use for scripting so what is scripting so scripting is nothing but uh, you write scripts to do some tasks for you so it's like automation so you can do automation with python so python is an object oriented uh, programming language like java and also a procedure oriented programming like language like c so python is mostly inspired by c so why did the author give the name as python so why anyone knows that so he gave the name as python because it's not because he love python it's not because uh, the name is so stylish he gave the name python because of one tv show that is like that he liked so much so there was uh, one tv show and uh, uh, guido van rusen was big fan of that tv show and the tv name of the tv show is monty python flying circus so guido van rusen was big fan of that uh, tv show so that uh, he named the programming language as python so the python name is uh, so stylish so this is all about uh, python's history tomorrow we will be seeing the demo of python how it looks and how we type code in that how to install python